today's daily shout outs congratulations guys if you guys want a chance to win a shout out on my next video just leave a nice comment down below also be sure to that subscribe button and drop a like and check out listingnoel.com for the merch and subscribe to my gaming channel hey guys welcome back to my <laughs> channel if you guys are new here hi my name is lissy welcome to the arcade family and today guys for today's video we're doing something i have never done before we're gonna be doing a challenge video and for this challenge i'm going to be eating only pink food for 24 hours i might just die because i usually eat pretty healthy foods for the most of it even though it definitely doesn't seem like when people look at me they assume that i eat cupcakes all day well today's video is going to be pretty much that <laughs> we're going to be eating only things that are pink for 24 hours and if they're not normally pink well i'm gonna have to make them pink by the way this video did start i think at lunch the other day so i finished it today with breakfast and snacks so you guys will see me looking different in a few different clips. Anyways, we're going to have to go to Target to get some supplies to eat pink. So let's show the clip from yesterday where I went to Target and I got some pink food supplies. Okay guys, so we are in Target right now and basically the goal here, by the way, we're in the Disney section because I feel like I matched. The goal here is I had to find all pink food so that I could eat them for 24 hours, guys. Okay, so I'm in the drink aisle right now and I'm looking for something pink to drink. What do we have here? I really like apple juice, but this isn't pink. This looks really good. It says that it's um, it says it has vitamin C. So I think I'm gonna try some pink cranberry juice because this sounds good and it's pink. Ooh, the chocolate aisle. I don't see any pink chocolate though. All right, we're in the snack aisle now and I'm looking for anything pink, but the only thing I found that has pink in it is this circus animal cookies. However, some of them are white, so we'll only have to be able to eat the pink ones. Into the basket. I can't find any pink cereal. Ah. So I'm looking at the baking aisle right now and I found these pink sprinkles and I don't know what I can use them for but they could definitely be useful for something. So I have to find a use for them. Strawberry cake. This counts. Into the basket. Okay, I found a frosting but we're gonna have to dye this to be pink. Okay, so for lunch I'm feeling like pasta so we're gonna have to dye some noodles pink. I think I have noodles at home. However, we can't use tomato sauce so we're gonna have to get some kind of Alfredo and dye it pink. And for dinner, I'm thinking we can do Alfredo pizza. <gasps> pizza crust. Oh, I have an idea. We can get some cream cheese and make it pink. Well, they have strawberry cream cheese, except for I don't like strawberries. So, yeah, we're gonna dye it pink. Gonna grab some mozzarella cheese. Don't mind if I do. Mom, do you think this will fit? No, I don't think so. I want this. <laughs> A few moments later. So I started off by pouring a glass of milk for breakfast and I also added in some pink powder which was strawberry milk mix to make my milk pink because it has to be pink. And then I had a bagel but I had to dye the cream cheese pink because, you know, it wasn't pink. So it kind of looked like icing but I just plattered it onto my bagel and it actually looks so good because it looks like cake, doesn't it? Like, look how good that bagel looks. Like, honestly, it looks so good. It looks beautiful. So yeah, that's my pink bagel and my pink milk. Okay, we have our pink breakfast. We have this pink bagel here. Honestly, guys, look. This looks like cake. Am I getting arrested for eating pink food? I hear sirens outside of my house. Anyways, this bagel looks like cake, literally. It looks like a cupcake but there's nothing special to it it's literally just a bagel with cream cheese it's pink i don't know if it's gonna make me feel sick or whatever because it's that pink i i don't think so it should just be like a normal bagel <laughs> hope this doesn't dye my teeth or mouth pink now for our strawberry milk because we can only drink pink drinks this slaps guys if you guys have never had strawberry milk for any given reason you're missing out. I remember when I went to public school, I used to have milk at like lunch or whatever. I always got the strawberry milk until one day, everybody got expired strawberry milk by accident. And then one kid threw up and then everybody threw up. And then I didn't have it for a really long time. But now I remember what I'm missing out on. <laughs> Ew, that's actually so gross. Trixie, you can't have this. No, it's not for you. It's a pink bagel. You're so cute though. Now on to lunch. So I made fettuccine noodles and I poured in my Alfredo sauce and I added a drop of pink dye and I mixed it into the pasta. That actually looks so gross, but yeah, that's pretty much it. That's, that's pink Alfredo and the pink cranberry juice that I got. Pink meal number two. 
we have pink Alfredo pasta. I am not sure if this is going to be good or if it's going to taste weird. I literally added a little bit of extra mozzarella. I added Parmesan. It looks nice and normal and gooey, but very pink. Um, and I only added like one drop of dye in and it's very, very pink. So we're going to give this a nice, good taste. Let's see how it is. It's actually really good, even though it's super weird and pink. That's yummy. This is not that bad, even though it's super pink and it's probably dyeing my intestines. At least it tastes good. Now to try my pink drink. My pinkity drinky. So we have the pink cranberry ocean spray. 70 calories per serving. Let's give it a taste. I hope this is going to be good. Oh, my nail. Oh, we got it. Let's see how this is. I've never had this drink before, so I'm hoping it's good because it's pink. It's not as flavorful as I thought it was going to be. It just tastes like normal juice. I mean, it's actually pretty good. It's refreshing, but it's not like super too sugary. So I like it. It's pretty good. So it's a little later now, and I really want a snack. So we're going to be having our circus animal cookies. And I feel like by the end of this video, I'm going to be really tired of either sugar or just artificial coloring. Or it's going to be really bad for me or make me feel sick. I'm not sure because I don't usually eat like this. But yeah, we're going to be eating only the pink cookies, which sucks because I don't know, do the pink ones or the white ones just taste better? One pouch is 150 calories. I think I can only have half the pouch, so I'm saving calories by only eating pink ones. <laughs> There's more whites in here. There's only these pink ones left and all the rest are white and I can't have them. This is my last cookie and I don't have any other pink snacks. I'm starting to already feel a very pink sugar rush. It's a lot of sugar. Then it was time for dinner. So I had the pizza that I had to make with the Alfredo sauce. So I just took the pizza out and I took my Alfredo sauce and I dyed it pink. And this actually pained me a little bit, not going to lie. And then when I poured it on my pizza, it looked like actual slime. And that actually looks so gross and disgusting. But you gotta do what you gotta do. Then I took my mozzarella cheese, added it into a little baggie, took a pink drop of dye and dyed my cheese pink and then i poured that on top of the pizza and then i put pepperonis in the shape of a heart baked it and yeah that's my beautiful super unhealthy pink pizza but it actually looks kind of aesthetic we have our dinner meal which is pizza but to be specific pink pizza why do I actually like this? I bet all this food coloring is so bad for me though. <laughs> oh my god, my fingers are turning pink. Then it was time for dessert, so you guys know what's up. I'm about to make the super moist strawberry cake. And I just kind of made my cake, you know, according to its instructions. And I just poured it into some cupcake liners because we're making cupcakes. Because, you know, I felt like making cupcakes. And then I just iced all of the cupcakes. And yeah, I actually made quite a few of them. I also took some sprinkles on there for decoration. And they were looking perfect. Look at that one. It looks beautiful. Okay, so it's dessert slash snack time. I already have icing on my fingers, but I'm going to be trying the little mini cupcakes that I made and look how good it looks. It is strawberry flavored Pillsbury cake, which I have not had, so I'm excited to try this. And it looks so beautiful. I even made sure that the wrappers were pink and the cupcakes were pink, so we're gonna give it a taste. That's good, but I am so sugar rushed out of all the pink food. Oh my gosh. Honestly, this challenge isn't so bad though. I'm actually kind of enjoying it. Honestly, it's the end of this challenge and I do feel kind of gross right now. Um, it was really good and tasty, like the pink cupcakes and everything, but I have a stomach ache! Ow, my toe! I hit it into something. Yeah, I might have had two cupcakes. Not one, but two. I had pink pasta, pink pizza, lots and lots of pink things. I don't recommend this challenge. I feel like I feel gross now. I feel like it was just so unhealthy and not good for me. I'm probably going to have pink throughout my system the next few days, if you know what I mean. But that's okay, at least I passed the challenge, woo! I was a survivor, I will survive. I ate only pink, pinkity drinkities. Anyways guys, if you guys enjoyed today's video, be sure to drop a like, be sure to hit that subscribe button, and be sure to leave a comment down below because I always love to read my comments because you guys are super sweet and yeah, I like to see what you guys say about my video. <laughs> Anyways guys, that's gonna do it for today's 24 hours of only pink food challenge. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys!
So that was it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to hit the subscribe button, be sure to drop a like, and be sure to leave a comment down below. I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.